everyone. I'm Gary Laubach of the Lafayette Sports Network. And I am sitting with two gentlemen who certainly are friends of Lafayette football. Fran Mastaro, who is the chairman of the steering committee for the Friends, and Frank Devani, who is one of their best friends. And I can assume, I believe, that if you have clicked on to this website, that you have an interest in Friends of Football. And Fran, I know you have an interest in telling us a little bit about what Friends of Football is and certainly to get some more members. Thanks, Gary. Uh, Friends of Football has been working for over a decade to uh, provide unmet needs for the football program. We do a lot of things with our over 400 members. Uh, we provide uh, w funds for uniforms and equipment. We uh, underwrite the uh, recruiting program for, uh, that's very important for, the, uh, for, the, for football right now. Uh, we also do a lot of other things uh, such as, uh, uh, as little, th little things like uh, uh, braces for knees and uh, uh, training table uh, mm -hmm. uh, funds and things like that. So we're, we're providing the, the uh, funds that uh, make the program work as well as it can be and allows Frank to get as much out of the dollars that he has uh, available. And uh, so we're always looking to uh, expand our membership and we currently have over 400 members. We raised uh, close to half a million dollars last year and some of our ambitious plans are to help underwrite the new scholarship program and try to provide uh, uh, some uh, extra funds to make that go up to the level that the Patriot League uh, has allowed. And so I, I just say that this is something that we're committed to and we hope to uh, continue to broaden our membership to raise funds to go the extra mile and uh, we call our uh, our members not only friends but difference makers. Mm -hmm. And Frank, uh, you of course uh, being an integral part of the Friends of Football and also the recipient of all the good works that they do, tell us a little bit about some of the things they have accomplished for you and your program. Well, it's just been, uh, it's been over the top is the best way I can describe it. You know, first off, just from the relationships that I've established uh, with that group particularly and then just the generosity and the outpouring of their hearts and souls into what they love you know Lafayette College and then particularly you know the football program and it was obvious to everyone when I took the program over in December of 99 everybody agreed we need to go on a national uh, recruiting base mm -hmm. which we weren't doing we were in a three-state regional base at that time um, our equipment was subpar and those were the two big things that I felt needed addressed at that time and started with a small group, uh, certainly no secret, uh, you know, with Jack Berry with that quickly expanded to others and he made contacts with people that hadn't been involved with the school or given a dime to the school since they graduated and now those people are thoroughly involved and engulfed in our program and embracing it. Uh, we have a sponsor of player program which is tremendous. These kids come in and brand new helmet, brand new custom equipment coming in, not hand-me-downs or anything. And all that is a huge factor in recruiting. So uh, you can't say enough about what they do, what they continue to do. And in fact, it just it never ceases to amaze me at, at, at what they're accomplishing and, and how they're able to continue to do it. But it takes extremely hard work from Fran and, and the steering committee particularly. And I think all you have to do is come here, look around at the facilities that we have. And boy, there, there aren't very many places that have anything better. Well, there's no doubt about that, and it's helped the school overall, which I think all of us are most proud of. I mean, we've got a we've got an X-ray unit in our building that is we, we are probably the least user of it. It's mm -hmm. mostly used by other athletes in the department, but even commonly the skateboarding student that uh, you know falls up on campus, which is nice that the doctor's able to send them down, and we're able to give back as a program. And I think. That's what's overlooked so many times is everything's about football and people, you know, think they get everything. Mm -hmm. Well, football does a lot, but they give so much back. The things that Friends of Football have helped other sports as well and the department, I think, is the part that gets overlooked and it doesn't get overlooked by me. Fran, let's hope that uh, whoever is watching this now is interested in becoming a member of Friends of Football. If they're not one already, how would they go about doing that? Uh, well, you heard it from the coach. It's an important program, important for, uh, important for football here to uh, become a member of Friends of Football. You can go to our website. You can uh, contact the uh, football office, and we'll, we're constantly uh, uh, sending out uh, uh, letters to members of the alumni body and also ex-players. It's a wonderful opportunity for, uh, for alumni, friends, ex-teammates ex, uh, to get together, reconnect with the college, with their friends, with the program and the coaches. Uh, 
and it's an opportunity to make a difference, and we encourage people to, to do that. You have been formally invited to join the Friends of Football. Thanks for spending some time with us.